Today is Monday, February 7, 2022. Welcome to your daily weather for the great city of Los Angeles. The temperature today should reach up to 75 degrees Fahrenheit and down to 58 degrees Fahrenheit. Humidity is at 10%. You can expect no rain and no snow today. Not many clouds. We've got moderate wind at about 6 miles per hour. Wind advisory remains in effect until 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time Monday. What north winds 15 to 30 miles per hour with gusts up to 45 miles per hour? Expected, mainly from Ventura through the Malibu coast to the Hollywood Hills. Where, Ventura County Coast and Los Angeles County Coast. Including downtown Los Angeles. When, until 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time Monday. Impacts, gusty winds will blow around unsecured objects and make driving difficult, especially for high-profile vehicles. Tree limbs could be blown down and a few power outages may result. Roadways that may be affected by gusty crosswinds include this includes Pacific Coast Highway, Highway 101, and the 10, 105, 110, 405, 605, and 710 freeways. And now for the news. Warning, some news stories can be disturbing or offensive. Stories are provided by various sources. Wow, I have no opinion at all, but what Leandra Kruger, a potential nominee, could bring to the Supreme Court. But even in defeat, colleagues recalled, she displayed remarkable composure. For our next story, Spieth risks life and limb in Pebble Beach High Wire Act Reuters. February 6, Reuters Jordan Spieth risked injury, or worse, when he boldly decided to play his ball from the edge of a cliff I. N.A. High Wire Act at the Pebble Beach Pro-Am in California on Saturday. For our next story, on paper, they were all wrong. But in time, just right. Right. At the ceremony, Ms. For our next story, SEAL candidate dies, another hospitalized after Hell Week test. SEAL candidates are seen participating in surf immersion during basic underwater demolition SEAL training at the Naval Special Warfare NSW Center in Coronado, Calif, in 2020. Next up, keep nuclear power plant open, urge 79 scientists, academics and entrepreneurs. On Thursday, Dr. Stephen Chu, former U.S. That's it for today. Have a good one. To help support improvement of our show, please click subscribe. See description for sources. This content contains information from OpenWeather TM API, which is made available here under the Open Database License ODBL.